Just at the end of the game with the Norfolk uh, City Cup, I'm um, with Harley here, um, who uh, captain the side. I think Harlem played fantastic football, went all the way with some really crunching tackles and closed us down well at Thetford. Um, just like your comments on the game. Uh, I thought we'd done really well, to be fair. The game plan was just keep it tight as long as we could, hopefully nick a goal, but missed a couple of chances. You know, it well, happens, yeah. didn't it? I thought, we'd done, I thought we'd done well in the end. I thought we'd done, gave a good account. But. Yeah, it was great. And uh, it's always nice to come back to a lovely club with great supporters and uh, a lot of Thetford support. And, uh, yeah, a relief that we obviously got a result. But I'll tell you what, you made us work for it. Yeah. Well, that was always the plan. That was always the plan. <laughs> it's, never gonna, it's, ne it's never easy to come here. We've shown teams that from higher divisions before. Yeah. But now we've done well. Happy with that. Yeah. And like I said to uh, many uh, supporters up there, I've played here a lot of years and uh, we should come across and give you a, a pre-season every year because it's yeah. such a, a gel between... Harling and Thetford, it's unbelievable. Um, I just try to look for any of my players about, but they're all gone in. Uh, I'm a kashar, and but uh, it's been a great experience, and I hope the club all the best in yeah, senior football. Yep, Thank like you very much. All the best. Thank you. Okay. Uh, yeah, we just uh, had an interview with Harry, uh, Harley Darren, and they worked really well, Dan, didn't they? They closed you down. They didn't give you any space, uh, and Volt are basically with a brace there, a um, couple of shots. Um, well, bro. Yeah, I thought we started like poor, but then on the second half we had like the coach give us a little shake off, and then we came on and we did what the coach asked, asked and created opportunities. And I was just waiting for my opportunity to put one in, and that's it. Tough game, Dan. Two two leagues below, but they're all tough when you play one down. So uh, we, although you could be critical of the team not playing the flair, um, it's a it's a result. Yeah, the, the the most important thing is is that we're through to the next round. Um, pleased with the clean sheet, and obviously Volta's showed a couple of uh, moments of brilliance to uh, to grab a couple of goals. Um, but overall, I'm really disappointed with us today. Um, I told them how hard the game was going to be. Uh, we we didn't start well. Um, they give a good account of themselves, to be honest. And you know, the longer the game went on, obviously the more chance they felt they had. But like I said, this man's come up again with a great, uh, great free kick, and then um, he's finished off um, with his second goal of the game. Um, so really pleased with uh, the goals, but like I said, disappointing performance from us all round today. Hey, on to the next game, uh, Norwich United. We've got to play a lot better, um, and also through the next uh, round of the Senior Cup, which it's got to be a good, it's got to be a goal for us, isn't it? Yeah, of course it is. I mean, um, minimum for me is to uh, go as far as possible in this competition. Um, like last year, you know, bitterly disappointed uh, going out to Wyndham when I thought we had a great chance. Um, so, you know, we want to go better this year. Uh, the aim is to go as far as possible, but performances have definitely got to improve if uh, we're, we're to achieve that. Yeah, well, thanks a lot, boys, and thanks for uh, a nice brace and uh, keep on scoring, mate. Thanks, Dan. Cheers, mate. Cheers. Over and out. <laughs>